we have a guest and it's Hunter Pence and Hunter how about Johnny Cueto oh he's a macho man <laughs> you like that don't you? you you like those macho men yeah yeah it was uh outstanding uh it's it's fun watching him work he's he's got kind of a you know that playful spirit out there and uh you know he, he breaks rhythm and and you got to be ready at any time for any pitch and uh it's, it's kind of fun watching him do that work so I, if i were to ask you what was it like facing him that would probably be your answer he, he just changes speeds right yeah, he's uh, he, he's tricky, and, and that's what that's what pitching is. It's um, you know messing with timing and and just missing barrels. And uh, yeah, he's definitely done pretty well against me. I think uh, back in the day when uh, the Astros Reds, as we were both coming up, uh, he threw me a lot of sliders away, and they're pretty good. Well, let's talk about your at bat. You got to do a, a quick O2 hole from Drew Pomerantz, who painted you with two perfect breaking balls to get O2, and then he throws a fastball. They set the target in on your hands with that cutter. They left it out over the plate, and you really jumped on it. You know, um, I kind of had a feeling I was either getting a high fastball or another one of those breaking balls. So, uh, you know, I, I know he probably wanted to come in and he went away with it. But, uh, you know, I, I didn't, you know, I think he sl supplied the pop right there. He, he left it a little bit uh, away from me and uh, I was able to catch it at the right angle and it found a way to get out of here. I want to talk about your other bat, too. When you hit the comebacker to the pitcher, we had you at four flat from the right side as, you know, they bobbled it and you were there to take advantage of it. Yeah, I mean, uh, a lot of times these pitchers with these uh, great arms, it's it's tough to, to mix up that throw, so you never know, and you just want to hustle down the line. Uh, and and uh, you know, I found a way to get on there, but it's it's just one of those things that you have an understanding that the pitchers, uh, it's it's tough for them to make that throw, and you want to you wanna give yourself every opportunity to get on base, especially in, uh, in a close game, and when Johnny's pitching as well as he is and Buster's calling him back there so good, uh, you never know. You know, uh, one last question, Hunter. It was probably about maybe 10 days ago, a couple weeks ago, you said in the clubhouse to us, you know, we need to be optimistic. This team is going to put on a good run, and that's what they're doing right now. Yeah, you know, that's the, the ebb and flow of baseball. Uh, I think I think you guys have seen a, a lot of a lot more baseball than I have. You've been a, been a part of playing a lot of it for uh, full careers and, and announcing. Uh, you have these highs and these lows, and, uh, you know, eventually the talent's going to find a way to, to win games, and you're going to start finding all the hits, and all the balls are going to be right at you. And uh, you got to know that that's going to happen, even in those down times when everything you, you hit at them and everything they hit squeaks in a hole. So uh, just keep plugging away and, and, and trust in the process. And, and like you said, you know, staying optimistic, it, it makes a difference. Hunter, for all the amateur coaches out there and the young players who watch this game tonight, thank you for that great hustle. Uh, thank you, Mike. All Too right, much. Hunter Pence, congratulations. Nice ball game. Way to go.